Yeah, this is a beautiful day to uh, wrap up the Anna Arbor Art Fair. We have got a lot of people opening up their booths, preparing for that 10 a.m. opening. The sun is out. Karen is out. So fun to be back and see you again. Now, this is the largest juried art fair in the entire state. This year it's a little smaller, but still pretty huge, right? Six to seven art hundred artists. Yes, yes. Normally we have close to a thousand, but with COVID, we decided it would be smart to kind of space things out, give people room to breathe. Um, so we invited less artists this year. Okay, but still close to lots. 700 artists. Yes, so lots and large. lots of artists. And some of these artists are still arriving, as you might imagine, with all the rain. They had to batten down the hatches and make sure everything stayed uh, nice and dry. But we wanted to show you. So this space right here, you're going to be seeing spaces like this, and that's on purpose. Yes, that you yes. did between every single booth is create these spaces. And why did you do that? We wanted to give people um, breathing room. Anybody who's been to the art fair knows how crowded it can be to walk through. Um, so we wanted to give more flow of traffic for people as they walk through this year. Okay, so you might see two booths together and then a space or one booth. And uh, we've got a, a two booths that are back to back here, a beautiful artwork. And I know we're gonna be speaking with uh, this artist a little bit later. So we'll give you a quick peek at this. And, uh, and then I love the art fair because there's so many different mediums from paintings to jewelry. There's just a little bit of everything. Can you give us the rundown of the types of different art that people could find? Um, so we like to say there's really something for everyone. We have all different price points, all different style and type. Um, we have jewelry, we have painting, we have drawing, we have photography, um, uh, clay, uh, wood, uh, metal. Um, so yeah, you name it, it's here. Okay, really. and this is covering how many blocks? 30 city blocks. So we still have the blocks. same footprint. Okay. Yeah, just a little bit less artists this and year. And a little more so. space for people to sort of move yes. about yeah. and uh, and find some of their favorites. This is really amazing. And we're gonna get a chance to meet and speak with some of these artists throughout the morning today. Um, let's just take a little walk here because some people are opening up their booths. We've got more jewelry here. Ooh, and it looks like some glass in the next booth. Just uh, such a beautiful variety. And these artists are from Michigan, but they also come from other... All over the country. All over the country. All it's a juried country. art fair, which means there's going to be a winner at the end, or no? It means... So there are awards given too, but um, juried means that they have to apply, and then they go through a, what's called a jury process. Um, so they get scored on their work. They send in digital images of their work. They get scored, and the high scorers do get invited. Okay, so not just anybody can show exactly. up. It is um, exactly. highly selective in order yes. to be a part of this. Yes. Um, the fair begins at 10 a.m and it ends tonight at 7 and it's seven. the last day it's the so. last day 10 a.m yep. to 7 p.m this today being the last day is also part of an adjustment for the pandemic yes. you used to go through sunday so today is your last day get on out here 10 a.m to 7 p.m in downtown ann arbor uh, jen i'm going to toss it back to you obviously i've got a lot of shopping to do i think i'm going to hand over my credit cards to matt my photog today just so i don't go too crazy